Howard came in and Durham looking to go 2-0 in the MEAC, while North Carolina Central looked to get back on track after a beatdown against FAMU. First drive of the game, Howard threatening as Newton cuts towards the end zone, but the NCCU defense holds and we get a field goal. Chauncey Caldwell got the start for North Carolina Central, and he marched the Eagles 91 yards down the field, and Isaiah Titan added the exclamation point to give his team a 7-3 early lead. Down 7-5 after getting a safety, Newton finds Jaquez Ezzard and he catches the ball in traffic and takes it to the house. 12-7 Howard. NCCU comes right back though as Caldwell finds Deshaun Stevens for a 35-yard strike down to the middle and in the second quarter the points were coming fast and furious. Speaking of fast, Jaquez Ezzard is a blur. He leaves his man back around Hillsboro, catches the ball, and finds the end zone again. This kid averages 23 yards per catch, by the way. Caldwell and company moving the ball, first on the run. And then on the 17-yard touchdown pass to EJ Hicks. The Eagles would add a field goal to make it 24-19 at halftime. Showtime did not make it down to Durham, so for the second week in a row, the sound machine gets it in all by itself. But they like it like that. Word to Cardi B. Caldwell stays hot in the second half, hitting Xavier McCoy with some love as he stretches the NCCU lead to 31-19, and NCCU looking like it just might pull away. But Newton comes back finding, you guessed it, Ezzard. This four-yard touchdown was his third of the day as he finished with eight catches for 174 yards for HU. The two teams traded field goals early in the fourth quarter as Howard cut the margin to 34-29 with nine minutes to go. Howard was creeping up on the come up though. Khalid Dorsey takes the handoff from Newton and does the rest. Goes 19 yards. HU takes a 35 34 lead over NCCU, but the two point conversion fails. And I, I I Sorry, we had to put a little dance break in there. Critical drive from North Carolina Central, and Caldwell would come up huge. Here he hits Hicks for a solid 15 yard gain. Then he does it by himself with a 30-yard gain on the ground, and the fans are starting to feel it. Back to pass, he finds Neek Martin for a 14-yard gain, and we are in the red zone. And down at the goal line, Caldwell takes it in himself for a three-yard score. He finished with 153 yards on the ground and 311 in the air. Tom running out for the Bison and NCCU fans can almost taste the victory. Newton back to pass for the game winner but he's picked off with Marcus Martin in the end zone and that is all she wrote. This game was an offensive showcase as the teams combined for over 1100 yards and nearly 60 first downs. Both quarterbacks passed for over 300 yards, but at the end of the day, the game belonged to Chauncey Caldwell. Oh yes, sir. This is only uh, this is we're just getting started. I will say that uh, we have so much to grow on. We have so many young dudes who are so good. I mean, Ike Martin, uh, Deshaun Stevens, two sophomores. We got two freshmen out there. Um, and we have Xavier McCoy. You know, he's a big body, you know, he's a great talent. So we definitely come back in tomorrow. And we have something to build off of. Thank you.